Roll up, roll up, all you fair weather woodworkers. You don't have to hibernate this winter. No. In a previous video, I was talking about this voice and how precious, how crap it was. Yeah. Well, it got me thinking it did. Yeah, when I looked at my little bench arrangement I got here, and this is what I use when I make my short videos, my talking head type videos. Well, I thought to myself, hang on, it clamps to the bench, it's portable, you can move it about. Hmm. It's quite a handy little thing to have with a vice Yeah. Now, okay, you can stick it in the back of your, your van or what have you, if you're, you know, professional woodwork or someone done a kitchen fit or something, you do the vice occasionally, you could use it for that even. And clamp it to a couple of deals on a, you know, on a couple of trestles or something, and then you've got a vice and a little bench to work off. Not a bad idea for that. But what about you keen hobbyists out there who love woodworking in the summer when the sun is shining outside, maybe? Or maybe you're in the garden shed. Or the garage. Or the summer house or something. Maybe you're in a tent. I don't know. Well, if you had something like this, that just clamps to some kind of bench. Or the kitchen table. Or you own going, don't you? You could bring your woodworking into the house. But easily take it out of the house when you're done. Or just leave it there because you sent the missus on a cruise. <laughs> you don't need to tell her. No. You keep all your tools on the knife rack. You can imagine it now. Above the stove. You have all your magnetic stove knife holder thingies. And it's full of chisels. Yeah. Because that's what I do. <laughs> well... I think this could be quite a handy little thing to make as a project. And it's very, very simple. If you look at it, it's just literally a top with a pair of wrap round legs and flat panels on the ends to stiffen it all up and what have you. So the load goes straight through into the table. And the, a rail at the bottom of which I can use these two clamps here to actually clamp it to this bench. And it's already got the vise attached. So all I've got to do is undo the two clamps and then I'm away. And I can use this to put all my sharps on so you don't have to put them onto the actual kitchen table. Now, if you've got like a melamine or one of them plastic finish type tables, don't do it. I hate it. I hate chipboard anyway. <laughs> well, then maybe you don't want to do this. Or if you are, make sure you put a bit of um, vinyl down like this. There's a bit of uh, vinyl, flooring vinyl on the table first and then clamp this down to, you know, sandwiching the vinyl so you don't damage your table. So you can do it. You know, it's quite easy. There's a couple of clamps like these and then you've got a, ta a bench with a voice, and you can happily play in your piece of wood, what have you. Okay, not for big projects necessarily, but you know, if you're just a keen woodwork and you like to do a bit of hobby work, I think it'd be quite a nice idea. I think it's a project to, you know, while you can still maybe do a little bit in the shed, make this now. So you can carry on woodworking through the actual winter months. I think it's quite a good idea. Yeah. Anyway, I hope it makes more videos, you know. Anyway, while you're here, please boop the old like button and uh, maybe subscribe to the channel. Yeah. And the little bell icon. Don't forget the little bell icon. Do you know why? Because every time I upload another video, long form video that is, you'll get a warm fuzzy feeling in the pocket that you will. Yeah. <gasps> oh, wouldn't that be nice? Oh. Anyway, for now though, I'm going to say toodaloo.